Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve if you're not seeing any high performance power options in your power plant section of Windows. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward tutorial and without further ado, let's jump right into it. So we're going to start by opening up the start menu. Just want to type in control panel here. I'm going to open up the control panel from the list. And now we're in here, you want to set your view by to large icons. Then left click on power options. Go ahead on the left side here and left click on create a power plan. So I'm going to select higher performance here and then underneath plan name you can name it whatever you want. So I'm just going to say my plan. Then I'm going to left click on next. If you want to set turn off the display, you can set that to never if you want to do higher performance. Left click on create. Now that we have our plan selected here, we can go ahead and left click and change plan settings, and then left click and change advanced power settings. You went ahead and scroll down to get to underneath display, right here. Expand that. Where it says turn off display after, you want to expand that, make sure setting is set to never. Once you're done with that, you want to go ahead, if there's anything that says battery or anything, when playing videos on battery, you want to make sure it's optimized video quality. So pretty straightforward. So going to multimedia settings when playing video, optimized video quality, and you also want to make sure any video playback quality bias, you want to make sure setting is set to video playback performance bias and when sharing media prevent idling to sleep so pretty straightforward and then you click on uh, apply and okay if you made any changes close out of here we we'll suggest restarting your computer and hopefully that was able to address your problem so as always thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial I hope I was able to help you out and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial Goodbye.